Right, good evening. Uh, it's a Wednesday evening and I'm back down on the Club Lake. Uh, I've come down for a night session. Uh, I've got here about three o'clock and I'm going to be off by seven o'clock in the morning. So I'll be packing up in the dark and then getting back into work looking really fresh. Anyway, <laughs> uh, the story goes, I came down on Monday night after work, uh, managed to feed up a few margin spots on the big lake. Unfortunately, uh, well, there's a big low pressure, uh, I say a big low pressure, there's been a low front coming across over the last couple of days. My goldfish were feeding really heavily uh, late yesterday. So I was really quite excited, thought I might be in with a chance of a bite. Uh, the two swims I fancied have both got people sat in. Uh, so fortunately, I didn't put all my eggs in one basket. I've pre-baited in more than one spot. Uh, so I'm on the small lake again where I've been trickling a bit of feeding. As you can tell, I'm full of man flu. Uh, but I'm going to be sat here all night fighting through. Uh, right, good morning. It's uh, 10 to 7. Uh, all my kit's packed away apart from the rods, which are just behind me. Uh, well, just behind you. Uh, and uh, throughout the course of the night, absolutely nothing has happened. So I'll see you the next time that I'm down here. There you go, update done. Uh, pretty pants. Yeah. Right, good afternoon. Uh, it's just gone 2 o'clock on Friday afternoon. Uh, I'm back down on the Club Lake for the, my first proper hit of 2017. I've got uh, tonight and up until about lunchtime tomorrow. Uh, I'll show you the swim in a sec, but I've got down here. It's forecast for wind and rain all day tonight, uh, all day today. Wind tonight, easing off to a bit tomorrow, drying off, and then a bit more high pressure comes in tomorrow. So at the moment, I've put two choddies out. Uh, just no, I've put about 20 boilies out over the entire swim in front of me. Uh, and I've got two little naked chods, little short naked chods with uh, something uh, brightly coloured on there, little uh, washed out white and yellow. And we're going to give that a go. So here's the swim. Basically, I've got one rod out in the open water towards the island over to the left there. And then the other one is in underneath the tree to the right there. Okay, quick status update just gone three o'clock and I've moved already uh, but in my defense I've just seen a fish show in line with that tree there so that's got a naked shot on it and the other rod is in line with that tree there right good morning uh, it's a uh, about half past eight in the morning last night it was a uh, started off wet, wet and wild and it quickly changed around to being a uh, quite cold very clear a flat car, uh, which isn't ideal conditions at this time of year. Uh, I had an indication at about nine o'clock, half nine last night, which saw me doing a recast on both rods, uh, simply because I thought I'd been done. So I was fishing with little chods like this at the time, and I just don't think I had enough of a bend in the actual chod bit. I and mean, all I've got is a naked chod to a little chod dropper, so I could have a three ounce lead on to overcome the crosswind that was on last night. Uh, and I think I had them free running too much, but it works for jib, I don't know, I don't know. I don't do enough chod fishing to know what I've done wrong, basically, if anything. Uh, so what I've done this morning, with the conditions having changed 180 degrees, is I've put out two zigs. I've got one out of two foot, one out of three foot, and they're gonna stay out for the rest of the morning now, until I pack up and go home. And we'll just see how it goes. Right, I need some breakfast, and I shall speak to you in a bit. All right, that's it, it's just gone past 12. I need to pack up and uh, get on my merry little way. Uh, it's another blank, but to be fair, it's winter. It's almost got to be expected. Uh, I'm off up to Cotswold Water Park next week, so I don't know what's going to be happening with the blog on that. But we shall suck it and see. Until the next time, however, I hope you do better than I do. I'll see you on the bank. <laughs> 